In this lesson, we're going to identify the properties and describe the results of a rotation applied to some given figures. We're going to rotate the object 180 degrees about A. So the first thing we'll do is mark on 180 degree rotation. And we're going to label our vertices. And now we select the vertices and the center and we rotate 180 degrees. Now for 180 degree rotation, it could be a clockwise or anti-clockwise. And we redraw the object to create the green image and we're going to label the image V. Now we're going to rotate the object 90 degrees clockwise about B. So the first thing we do is we mark on 90 degree rotation clockwise, 90 degree clockwise rotation. We label our vertices and we're going to rotate the vertices and the center by 90 degrees. And we will redraw the object to create the image, which will label W. Now, if I was doing this with pen and paper, rather than rotating the center, I would pivot from the center using tracing paper. But in this case, I'm going to realign, realign the center once I've done the rotation. Moving on, we're going to rotate the object 180 degrees. So we'll mark off 180 degree rotation. And we're going to rotate by 180 degrees and reline up the center and redraw the image, which we will label Y. And finally, we're going to rotate the object 90 degrees clockwise about C. So we will label the vertices, mark off 90 degrees on our center, 90 degrees clockwise, and select the vertices and the center. And we're going to rotate it all by 90 degrees clockwise, line up the center again, and redraw the image, which we will label Z. Thank you for watching, I do hope you found it useful and check out the description for the link.